Thank you, Thumb. Welcome back to Let's Play Empyreon Galactic Survival. We're back here on Sant, our temporary home away from home amidst the stars, as we journey and try to find this uh, this mystical planet where we're going to race some drones in an epic final battle to determine whether I can race drones effectively. Uh, today I kind of feel like going on a bit of adventure. So we're going to go and try and uh, find a, a likely looking POI to hit and uh, hit it. Uh, we are going to need to do some serious, serious Promethean mining here uh, while we're on this planet because we're starting to run low. Uh, probably should get some iron as well and some magnesium. As you can see, I'm burning through my stocks quite rapidly. This is all I have left and I'm, uh, I'm spending it on just making as many bullets as I can. Oxygen wise, we're doing okay. We've got a bunch of purple bottles scattered around the place. So even though we can't get oxygen on this planet, uh, I'm not too worried about that. Um, I am worried about all this random crap I've stuffed in the constructor, but I'll deal with that another time. So while that's going on, I'm actually going to have a have a run around with the repair stick and just fix up some of the broken, uh, dented panels on this base. I put the dents here, of course, and uh, I should I really I do keep saying I'm going to going to fix all this broken shit, and this feels like the time to do it. So, I will rejoin you in probably about five minutes when the ammunition's ready. Uh, well, I got bored of repairing things and I came to check on the farms. Um, at some point, the plants have all died. Which is what you'd call not good. The Kavai beans have survived, but they don't give any uh, nutrition. It's probably when I turned the power off that time and all the oxygen escaped. Or it could just be because we've been in space. Never did quite work out exactly how the uh, how the plants died. When we took the ship over, remember it had a bunch of dead plants on it. But uh, yeah, that's a problem. So all my all my plants are dead. I've got no source of food. I'm down to a f well, I'm down to a few cans. Uh, I do have a whole bunch of various different kinds of food in the fridge. It just means I've got to keep coming back to uh, back to base every time I'm hungry, or just dying and respawning here. But in that case, then I've got to go and get the ship afterwards. Did I just see something red? Something on red health. I don't know. Anyway, let's check in on the ammunition. Okay, well that's about all we're going to get. Where's my minigun? Uh, I put all the weapons away somewhere because I wasn't going to bring any of them except the assault rifle. And I've got to find them again. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, that's probably that was probably just spoiled food anyway. I wouldn't have put food in the in the cargo boxes. Here we are, epic minigun. So we're taking the rifle, the minigun, the pistol. And uh, this rocket launcher, because I've been carrying 40 rockets around in my inventory for ages. Might as well get some use out of them. Right, let's go and find something to destroy. Well, actually, uh, can I... Do I have enough stuff to make another core? We should take a core with us, if I can. We claim a base on this planet, maybe. Yeah, I do have enough for a core. Okay, I'm going to make this core and then we're going to go uh, go visiting. I'll tell you what I was going to do as well before I forget. I'm going to make a blueprint of this uh, explorer. Uh, I believe it was right alt O. No, maybe left alt O. Right, that's the EX7 Explorer blueprint, that's saved, so if it gets blown up we can uh, make another one somehow. How expensive is it to actually build it? Let's see. Uh, EX7 Explorer, it's not that bad actually. One and a half thousand iron more or less, but only small amounts of everything else.
Right, there's my core. So we'll blow up, we'll take a base over on this planet. Uh, for some reason, I don't know. I just want a base on this planet, I suppose. Right, I don't think I found anything last time apart from that uh, neutral PI. Have we actually have we actually explored this planet at all yet? I don't think we have. Right, let's go off uh, and have a bit of a fly around then. What's this over here? This looks like just a neutral POI, but it could be something. It's got that modular look to it, and no guns, I don't think, which means it's probably just a neutral one. Shuttle hub. Yeah, no guns, no fun. Sod off. Fucking cannon drone took a pot shot at me as I flew past. Well, there's a cluster here. One of these might be a uh, might be a bit of good sport. Let's have a look. Well, that fuel depot's got guns on it. That's a definite target. I would normally have more railguns than this, but this was all the materials we had, apart from what I spent on making that homing rocket launcher that I couldn't even load. Since when can drones shoot upwards? Right. Park ourselves here, I suppose. Power off. Seventy pistol rounds we will take. There's not a lot of local life on this planet. I hope that thing's not gonna start Oh jeez, look at all them drones. It's like the Alien King Palace all over again. Right, we should be close enough to have a look at what we're dealing with now. Got a couple of spawners in a really awkward place. I might have to take those out from the air. And that's... Well, it's not exactly much of a POI, is it? Oh, God. Maybe I should go and strip the guns off the d the um that must be the drone base. Look at them. I should totally go and strip those guns off before I uh, attempt anything. Maybe we'll attack the drone base if we can. I know that sounds like a recipe for disaster. It was last time we tried it, but maybe this time we can actually take out the drone spawning blocks somehow. How much ammo have I got left? A decent amount. We've got no rockets. We've got one Gatling gun, which has probably got no ammo in it. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if we can do anything. Why do the bases always have to be all clustered together like this? I miss the days where you could take the bases out one at a time. We've got to go in way high for this, because there's drones all over the place. Have I lost my front jet or something? I'm in a real time going in reverse. Son of a bitch, that drone got in the way. Ok, 
Okay. Uh, with my remaining rounds... I don't think that, that transport didn't drop anything off again, it looks like. Can't see anything moving down there. With my remaining rounds, let's go and uh, try and clear this one off as well. So there's no static gun emplacements left. To give us any shit. Are there guns on this one? It looks like there are. Yep, they're moving at us. Oh shit, there's one left on the drone base as well. Oh, something just blew up. Wasn't any of the guns, which is a good thing. Oh god, there's, there's actually two turrets left on there. I don't think I've got enough ammo to clear it out now. Okay, that one is clear, but I definitely don't have enough to clear out the guns on the other one. Any of the other guns still loaded? We've got about 300 Gatling rounds and one Gatling gun, and no rockets. Jetpack. Jetpack. No, no jetpack. Oh god. Save me, heavy combat armor. Fuck off. Well, I wanted an adventure. I've really got to start building these things with Sathium blocks. Um, respawn at your home base on Sant. Respawn at Alien Invader. Let's respawn at the Invader. We can at least uh, use the medic station here. Get ourselves back at full health. Not the constructor. This has been switched on for ages. Power's draining rapidly. Does it have am any ammunition? It has one 15mm bullet in it. That's not really going to do the job. Where did we die? I bet it was miles away. So, uh, it's not that far actually, it's over there. I can't believe I left this switched on. Oh well. We've got a very, very small... We've got a few rockets and a very small amount of... Um, Gatling ammo. I wonder if I can actually get over there with the cap ship. Put these minigun turrets to some use.
I'm gonna try, screw it. Sorry about the darkness by the way, but of course I don't have my uh, my night vision goggles anymore. Temporarily, temporarily. Right, we need to go... Oh, hang on. Turn the LCS on as well. Right, we've got six minutes. No, two minutes. Jesus. 1.7 minutes. We're going the wrong fucking way. Why... How am I going the wrong way? I'll fly... That's right, the compass is screwed up on this planet, isn't it? I don't think we're going to make it even. No, this is stupid, we're not going to make it. Oh, what the fuck did I just blow up? I hope it was just a minigun turret or something. Uh, no, I think I'm going to have to... Uh have to figure something else out. We could have made it if the compass wasn't fucked up. Ugh. Ow. Oh god, we're already taking fire. There's a drone on us. Oh, we're not going to get this. Shit. Oh, there's the... My ship just fell from the sky. Did you see that? Oh, this is a disaster. No. Fuck. What the fuck? I just want my backpack, you sons of bitches. There's even an arachnid there now. Just let me get my backpack and I'll be gone. Okay, at least we've got it out of the way of the heavy cannons now. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Skittering along the ground there. Maybe those drones will disperse now that they've destroyed both of my ships. No, we're not even out of range of the heavy guns yet. Okay, well let's let those drones should piss off now that my both of those sh both of my ships are dead, and yeah, I'm not going to be nearby. So let's actually uh, respawn at the Alien Invader. Maybe we can make another motorbike. Ah, 
How's my armor holding up? It's nearly broken. Uh, but we'll keep trying. I'm not. I'm not going god mode again. I don't care. Uh, apparently, I had a bike kit already made up. Got an egg. There we are. Makes it all worthwhile. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure what blew up. Something blew up. Might have just been a bit of a uh, bit of the paneling. Right, is this the is this the way I'm supposed to be going? No, it's the other way. The compass basically just does whatever the fuck it wants. Now I'm now west is west. Before west was east, I don't know. Right, where's the backpack? Oh god, they're still here. Well, they're, they're very close by anyway. Yes, yes. Rawr, scary. Give me all that shit. Get the fuck up, poisoned bastard! I can't believe he poisoned me. Uh, we nearly escaped then as well. Now we're back in range of the deadly green turrets. But you, you son of a bitch, you've ruined everything. Okay, well, motorbike construction kit was green, so we can make another one. This is uh, this is the kind of adventure I'd planned on. But I'm going to be fucking over the moon if I just manage to get my backpack. I've got to make a bike to go and get the bike that we just lost. Man, drone base is a fucking killer in this patch. Remember the old days when there just used to be like one or two drones buzzing around? You'd take them out, destroy the drone block, and they'd never trouble you again. Things have certainly changed. Try a little, little ring around the rosy to try and get that arachnid away. Oh jeez, we are very, very, very much in range of that fucking thing. Where is the backpack even? It's here. We made it! Ah, oh, come on, we got to get back. Got to escape. We could even try and fly the explorer back. Uh, I'm not sure that's the best idea. I get back to the invader and take stock, I think. Well, we're out of range of everything. Let's get, uh. Get re kitted here. Right, so we've got our guns back at least. Alright, so, sit rep. Uh, if we. Don't kill this spider, we'll be in trouble. Alright, uh, let's think about the situation then. So, both of our ships are wrecked and in range of green guns, so we're going to be absolutely fucked the moment we try and take off with them. Plus they're swarming with drones in that area. Um, we don't have a lot of materials on hand back at base. Uh, what we do still have is the ability to mine. So maybe we uh, maybe we try and maybe we could do some space mining. 
Maybe that's the thing we can... Do you know why I haven't... I've never tried space mining? There's asteroids up there in... Uh, up there in that there space. So probably what we need to do is go and get some Prometheum. There was a Prometheum node actually right there. Right next to the alien invader. So let's go and do that Prometheum mining we were talking about. I'm just giving up those two ships for lost. Uh, we'll find something else. Right, Ash, I've got my night vision back. We need to find a planet with like proper proper resources on it. Right, so we're going to get a lot of Prometheum, like a lot of Prometheum. Right, let's get that terrain removal on first of all. I'll switch to torch mode because it's easier to, easier to mine with I find. Sweet, sweet Prometheum. Oh, my bike just uh, turned back into a kit and fell into the fell into the hole. I wonder what that was then for a second. Okay, we've got a, a larger quantity of Prometheum, so let's get this back in, uh, on the boil. Um, I suppose while that's being processed, the best thing we can do is drive around and look for some warp crystals. Uh, I don't think there's any real reason for us to linger here on this planet. We need to restock on like all kinds of stuff. I'm going to grab some of this plasma. We'll keep this planet in mind because it's a good place to come and uh, come and farm T6 for the large health kits, but we're also going to need to go elsewhere. So I'm thinking I might actually want to jump back to... Am I going the right way? Where's my uh, entry ramp? Uh, which side is easier to get in on, actually? Probably this one. Um, if I can actually get back in the invader at all, uh, I do need to restock on some food. Oh yeah, there it is. Um, the only place we can go for guaranteed food, now that these plants on board have all died, is the, the base back on uh, Ilia. Way back at the start. We need a lot of warp crystals to get there, but it's preferable to just hoping that we find a food source elsewhere in the galaxy, I think. Right, you. Uh, take these and start turning them into large packs. Just as many as you can. I don't think we'll get a hundred out of you, will we? Three, seven, nine... 3790. Maybe we will. Go for 200. Right. While that's going on, then, uh, I guess we'll get the bike out. It's our only vehicle at the moment. So let's ride around in the darkness looking for warp crystals. Drive past that at a very safe distance. Growling at me. Is it something I can kill? Or is that just the sound of my bike on this rough terrain? No, it's just my bike. Thank god the bike has no fuel requirements. I suppose it won't be so bad having to start again from, well it's not exactly starting over from nothing, we are level, pushing level 20, level 15. We do have a lot more unlocks this time. Bit of adversity to spice things up a bit. The occasional, uh, occasional misfortune. 
keeps things it keeps it keeps things interesting most definitely. In fact, that's my story. I meant for that to happen. It's all in the script. So if we we're planning a jump all the way back to Mai, that's uh, 37 warp crystals. That's a lot of a uh, lot of crystals to collect. We have got a few left in the tank, not that many. Oh, I missed a, I missed loads over there. Actually, there's one there, one there. Gotta keep an eye on my oxygen levels as well. Is that a golem I just drove past? Yeah, one of the planetary golems. Let's see what he has for us. Promethium, nice. Lots of resources. Oh, there's another one over there. We do need resources as well as we need pentaxid, so we should kill the golems when we see them. Not so bad this planet really. We've only found one poisonous monster so far. There was something that looked rather like an Otio, but sort of leaner and meaner. I'm not running to one of those again just yet. The golems are fantastic here. Is that another one over there? Sneaking around behind that uh, behind that ridge. Or was that my motorbike falling off the edge? Right, I'm down to about half oxygen, so I should think about heading back to the invader at this point. Yeah, definitely. How far have we actually come? We've had, we've come a fair distance on the old motorbike, all the way across to the opposite uh, opposite side of the Great Desert here, and up in the mountains. We have to be in the mountains to find the crystals. I don't think they spawn in low-lying uh, biomes. Oh, there's another golem. Still there. No, he's vanished. He knows I'm out for blood or whatever golems have. Check out that sideward skid down the mountain. Right, east is still east, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know, maybe I just made a mistake. I'm pretty sure the compass has been funny on one of the planets. But... I don't know. Maybe I just, may, maybe I just made a mistake when I was flying the capital ship. No... Can't do wheelie jumps or anything like that on the bike. It's a big shame. That would be quite fun. Well, here we are. Let's check on that Prometheum. So, that's about all the time I've got for this episode. Uh, we're... We're definitely giving up the Stealth Fighter and the Explorer for dead. We've got the blueprints for both, so we can rebuild them if we want to. But it might be time to think about uh, a new SV, because we have only used two designs so far in this Let's Play. Or, well, four if you count this capital ship, which we didn't really design, and the Explorer, which we didn't really design. Uh, but we also had that hover vehicle that we had back on, back on Mai, which is probably still there somewhere. So let's have a look at this. You've only output 12 things in all the time I've been gone, really. Bet the power's gone out, hasn't it? Yep, power's gone out. Oh well, uh, I need to refill my oxygen tanks from the main oxygen tanks anyway. Let's chuck that pentax in. We've got four AUs worth in the warp tank already. So 
reasonable Prometheum Pentaxid. Let's throw that meat in the fridge for now. Things are starting to spoil with the power keeps going out. Uh, right, so let's have uh, let's have some pizza and fries and maybe a pumpkin cookie and finish off with some pear things. So that just about does it for another episode of Empyreon. Uh, like I say, we are going to be looking for a, a new small vehicle, uh, which means we're going to be looking for the resources to build one. Now, do I have access to, just before I go, do I have access to the CV mining turrets? The drill turrets I do not, they're level 20. That's a shame. Uh, so we're going to be doing a bit of EVA mining if we do decide to go to the asteroids. But we may not, who knows. Uh, that's a question for next time anyway. In the meantime, I've been Eki Thorn. that's been Let's Play Empyreon Galactic Survival. Do it, we've enjoyed it. Like and subscribe if you'd like to see more gameplay of this game. And uh, I will see you next time.